What's up, everyone? And thanks so much for hanging out with me today as we go ahead and take a look into the Big Bang Theory season number two. This is episode number 16. And as usual, I hope that you guys are a fan of the show, Big Bang Theory. Hopefully you guys are enjoying what we do here in Geeked Out Nation. And if so, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and check us out on Patreon and get some early and unedited videos if that's something you guys are into. So quickly, um, one thing I wanted to touch up on, guys, based off what we saw in the last episode was that Leonard and Penny kissed each other again. And you guys know how I felt about that whole entire situation. And I'm not really too happy about that. I mean, like last time, because if you guys remember, they did kiss each other one time. But like last time, they were super drunk when they did it. And they they were super drunk this time again. And I don't even know if it's to a point where they'll even remember by this episode coming around. If they do remember, I mean, can we actually get somewhere, please? I mean, I'm so sick and tired of the whole, oh, are they going to be together? Oh, no, Leonard, you're too smart for me. Oh, no, this is this is happening. Oh, I'm going to get back with my ex. Like, come on, guys. We're not in third grade. Let's just, let's just cut to the chase. Are we going to be a couple? Are we going to stay as friends here? That's the only thing that I really wanted to touch up on, just because I'm not a fan of seeing this whole... Every time that something happens between them, it's when they're super drunk or they're not going to remember or the excuse is super lame. Because in my opinion, Penny's excuse for why she didn't want to be with Leonard in the first place was kind of lame. But that was just what I thought. And um, I kind of hope we kind of see them discuss this a little further because like last time when they did do this kiss uh, and they were super drunk, they didn't really talk about it, but... I forgave them because they were drunk, but again, they probably were super drunk again, so they probably don't remember. But I hope that they remember something to where we could get past this little this little hump that I don't feel like we ever got past yet between these two, whether they're going to date or not. So, um, like I said, that was the only thing that I really wanted to touch up on. But other than that, let's enjoy the show, guys. This is The Big Main Theory. Here we go. Was in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, still funny, Raj. I like paint. I like paintball. That shit hurts. No way we can get to the ranch. The chemistry department has us completely cut <coughs> off. What about the creeps? I forget. Which one is Hammer of the Gods? We have the dumpsters <laughs> in the parking lot and ambush people when they come to pee. No, the Ew. dumpsters are deep in astronomy department territory. That's kind of messed up, Raj. <laughs> during the day. They're probably just all staring at the sky. <laughs> I'm going to burst out the door and run away. Howard will cover us. <laughs> oh. run away and you cover me? Because Poor Howard. He's going to get so messed up. <laughs> He's going to get so messed up, watch. Howard, I'm on your team. Oh, it's Leslie. Oh, Leslie, thank God. What's up, Leslie? Where's Leslie? <laughs> uh, they left me here to die. Yeah. <laughs> He's... <laughs> it makes you feel more alive, doesn't it? <laughs> it kind of does. War is hell. <laughs> <laughs> what? This is so crazy. Leslie and Howard? No way. I did not expect to see that. New budget memo that went out this morning. Yeah, more cutbacks. I wonder how Leonard's gonna feel about that. I mean, he shouldn't be mad, but I wonder. So that there's money available for my research. Ow! That sounded to me like an African civet cat. Oh my God. Are you done? No. Despite what you didn't cover our escape and let us get cut down like animals. <laughs> Oh, yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> then what difference does it make? What difference does it make? Here we uh oh. It's <laughs> my spot. In an ever changing world, it is a single point of consistency. <laughs> if my life were oh my gosh. to function on a four dimensional Cartesian coordinate system. <laughs> <laughs> this is so odd. Boy, your heart's racing. I'm neck opened up again. <laughs> Just tell your mom you're going to sleep. Oh, <laughs> she's about to go off. Oh, there's the arrhythmia. Is she Jewish? <laughs> Are you Jewish? No. Yes. <laughs> okay, then you kids have fun. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Damn, that's. I wouldn't even clean it. You think he'll notice? I mean, like, Penny did this. There's a chance. <laughs> oh, 
Rocky for like a year and a half now. Yeah, you tell her. You tell her. Right now, you are you and you are screwed. <laughs> right? <laughs> Why do we have to tell him Our boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> what if we just flip it over? I was thinking flip it. Oh, that should work. Yeah. Looks fine, right? Mm, but hello, fastest man alive. Look, he's gonna know once he sits down. Watch. Want to see it again? I am leaving. If I was Penny, the moment he sits down. <laughs> yo, get the yo, Sheldon. You're yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> there's no way he could tell that the chair like is a there's Something's a difference <laughs> like yo how what do you mean it doesn't feel right <laughs> how can he tell what you're talking about right no way he flips it <laughs> oh that penny did that <laughs> oh he threw her under the bus <laughs> <laughs> Sheldon, oh my goodness. <laughs> you just desk chair? Why don't I just eat in my desk chair? Here we go. Is it flexible? Uh-oh. What is he gonna say? Yeah, sorry, I didn't really think that. I'm gonna have sex tonight. <laughs> what? Hey, She's probably gonna call it off, watch. When did that happen? Just About now? 12 seconds ago. <laughs> you should have never said that. <laughs> Hold on, are you not? <laughs> Good as new from that key maker. I highly doubt it. Just take a look at it, Sheldon. Come on, Come on Sheldon. Just give it a try. Right. All right. Ouch. I was about to say, let us know, Sheldon. Is it good or is it good? <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm guessing it smells good. That was fresh. No way. What do you mean, nope? What's wrong with it? Nothing. It's what's wrong with him. <laughs> it's exactly the, the same. Penny, Penny, I think I know what to do. Dragon. Why is that a bad thing? It shouldn't be bad if you're eating it. <laughs> yeah, well, before they went out of business, I bought 4,000 containers. Damn. I keep them in the trunk of my car. View as Penny runs out and kills everyone else in sight. Oh <laughs> yeah, I'd be start. cool with that. <laughs> oh no, we're about to fight each other in here. I'm sorry, Leonard, but revenge is a dish best served cold. Damn, you took her out. Screw that. Oh, they're about to fight each other. He's right, you can't. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to say, I'm out of there, you guys. Where are you going? To fight. And Denny's. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is our episode for today. Season number two, episode 16 of Big Bang Theory. And it, yo, it was funny, man. You guys see me laughing from beginning to end with this episode so i'm not gonna go ahead talking about everything we t like literally just watched i mean that would be kind of boring and pointless on my end but it was fun it was a fun funny ass episode now some of the things that i did want to touch up on um and it's nothing major it's just a little bit of things that i won't even say i have an issue with but just things that i felt like i needed to talk about quickly the thing that i said in my intro about Shell, uh, Leonard and Penny remember the last episode they kissed they were super drunk la 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 this is the second possibly third time these guys kissed each other and nothing was said right after and I, I don't I don't like that um I forgave it the first time because they were drunk I'm going to let this one slide again because once again they were drunk but I'm going to be honest with you guys, man. If there's another drunk incident where these two end up kissing each other and nothing results after this as far as... And I'm not talking about Penny and, and Leonard having sex or anything. I'm talking about be a couple. Be an item to each other. Be in a relationship. Like, that's what I want. I'm sure that's what we all want. 
I don't like to see the playing around all the time. Like, I, it's cool. But then it's like, I feel like if you give us too much of that, when we do get the moment of them being together, it's not going to be as sweet and special. You know what I mean? Like, that's that's kind of how I'm taking it right now. So, um, I really think that Leonard and Penny will be an awesome, like, couple. Like, I think they'll be great together. But like I said, like, if they continue to just keep throwing stuff at us like this, to me, it's just not going to be as sweet as if, you know, as if, like, if they were just to get together, you know? I, I would prefer that than tiptoeing around it you know and that's what I felt like we've been seeing for quite some time now even since the first season so far and and again I'm not shitting on it or nothing I'm just saying like I want to see them make it official already man I'm sick of the the little games we keep seeing that they're playing with us um the second thing I wanted to discuss guys was Howard and talk about surprise the last person I would ever expect to sleep with Howard was Leslie and yet that happened multiple times in this episode um, and it's nothing crazy. I just, I was just surprised by it. And I mean, I really like Leslie. She's funny as hell. And, uh, if you guys watch my reaction to 24, I just recently found out I'm in the second season of that show. If you guys are a fan of that show and, and you guys did not know I was reacting to, uh, the show 24, definitely go ahead and check that out. But, um, yeah, recently I just found out cause I'm on the second season of that show that, that, uh, Leslie, she's playing a character on that show, which probably probably she'd be there for the whole season um I'm not sure how long she's on the show but I know for sure she's definitely in the second season uh but she's playing a different character named Paula I was gonna say Paola (laughs) but Paula I think that's her name or something like that so that was just interesting I just wanted to throw that out there for you guys in case you guys didn't know that already um but yeah like I was saying though this episode was just so funny man um Shelton takes things a little too in my opinion, just too serious. Like the whole seating arrangement, the whole couch being messy and the fact Penny flipped it and he he had to sit down and, and he kind of was like, oh, this doesn't feel right. Like Sheldon, just sit down. It's just a chair. It's all good. Like it's just a cushion. You know what I mean? I don't know. Sheldon's funny as hell. Like I said, the Leslie and Howard thing completely threw me off guard. Did not expect those two to even be together like on screen like this like it's just so weird and crazy to see um I am surprised though that Leslie is actually treating Howard a bit better than how she was treating Leonard I mean am I wrong or am I right I mean in the first season when Leslie and Howard uh Leonard were a thing she wasn't going as crazy and and buying Leonard crazy amount of things they were just having sex and that was it but here it seems as if she really kind of likes Howard a little bit um at first, it kind of seemed as if she was just doing this just so she could have sex, and, and that's, that was kind of it. Um, but then the conversation kind of changed. I mean, I don't know. I don't know whether she likes Howard or not, or she's just using him for sex. So hopefully, in the next episode, we get to see whether or not if they're together or not, or hopefully we could just have Leslie around the crew a little longer. She's funny, man. She's cool, and I really, really like her. She's She's just awesome. And uh, I love it the most when she goes back and forth with uh, Sheldon. I think those two are funny. Um, And I think overall, Sheldon was just hilarious this episode with this overdoing everything. Like I said, guys, the whole couch, uh, the whole cushion uh, seat being all messy. He's acting like crazy. Like he's he's sitting in the chair, like the empty spot. But like you you guys seen we, we literally just seen what happened. You guys know what I'm talking about. Sheldon in this episode just stole the show man he was just so so funny man I couldn't stop laughing every single time he he was on the screen because he was always doing something so so ridiculous um what else and I think that's it like I said though guys um like I said with the whole Penny and Leonard situation I'm not sure what's going on there I'm not sure if there's gonna be anything there or not all I know is if they do do anything there, it's not going to be as like satisfying for me, at least maybe for you guys. But for me, I know if we keep going in the direction that we're going in, as far as them keep having moments here and there, to me, it's not going to be as sweet and special when they actually do have that moment of getting together and actually being a couple, which that's what I don't want. I want it to be where when they do get together, we're like, yeah, you know, like we're excited. We're happy. Not saying that when they get together, I'm not going to be happy, but it's just not going to be as like, 
you know, it's going to be more like, oh, I already expected it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I already knew this was happening. So it's just not as awesome. If if what I'm saying makes sense, hopefully you guys understand what I'm saying. Um, but that's all the time we have for today. I thank you guys so, so much for tuning in. And as always, man, I'll see you guys in the next episode of The Big Bang Theory.